Hey, everybody. Hope you are doing well. It's time to visit some more music by the First Lady of Soul, Miss Aretha Franklin. And um, this is the song, uh, Share Your Love With Me. And, uh, you know, it's, it's about three minutes long, a little longer than that. But it's um, just, again, it's another one of those just amazing examples of how phenomenal her voice was. So uh, without any hesitation, without any further ado, let's check out Share Your Love With Me by Aretha Franklin. Sorry about the break there, but there are helicopters flying overhead right now, and I'm trying to do this in between there, making a loop around the hill that's behind my house. I'm telling you, really, it's freaking irritating because they just they love flying around that hill, and it just always blasts out my microphone. So I, I had to wait for them to at least at least temporarily fly away so I could finish this. Um, listening to a song like that, you can fully understand why so many uh, vocalists idolize Miss Aretha Franklin, um, why she stands so tall on that pedestal of uh, female vocalists in history. Just un, un, unbelievable. And um, I don't think I've 
come across too many uh, reaction channels who have had, you know, like, you know, you see those reaction channels with vocal coaches or opera singers or whatever it is, listening to music and critiquing the vocalist. I don't think I've seen too many, if any at all, um, of those channels focusing on somebody like Aretha. Now, whether it's because they know that Aretha is a god goddess in that uh, in that world of female vocalists, um, or what it is, I I don't know. But uh, you know, they seem to spend an awful lot of time listening to metal artists, which I, I got no problem with that either. But um, somebody like Aretha needs to have, um, I guess, I. I guess I don't know if she needs to, but I think it would be interesting to see more light shed on her vocal stylings and her her range and abilities um, compared to what currently is out there. It's almost like, you know, some of these legends, they pass away and without uh, people calling attention to them, they sort of get forgotten about. And then younger generations don't really know the origin of the influence that um, was had on their favorite modern vocalists because those modern vocalists did go back and listen to Aretha uh, and other artists like Billie Holiday. So, um, yeah, I, I, I would it would be interesting. There's a, there's a couple of... Uh, vocal coaches and opera singers that I've seen on YouTube that I, I think would be really interesting to watch them listen to um, listen to Aretha and some of the legends uh, in the soul genre and the blues genre too. Um, yeah. With that said, again, amazing performance. I mean, oh my God, her power, her range, her her just ability to emote uh, the soul and feeling from every song that she sang was just extraordinary, and uh, I, I, I just, I, I, lo I love her voice. So, hey, with that said, thanks for watching. Please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below, and we can talk about it further. And um, know that I appreciate y'all, and I wish you all well. Take care.